hi everyone welcome back to my channel in today's video i'm going to be showing you guys my purse collection i know it's a little different from the normal content that i put on my channel but honestly my second favorite thing to collect is purses i absolutely love purses that was the very first thing i started collecting actually um before i got into perfumes and the only reason i don't have more than what i'm going to show you today is because i stopped buying them just because i started buying perfumes and both of those little obsessions are pretty expensive i would say my collection is very affordable now i know affordable is very different for a lot of people i know it's not a necessity it is definitely a luxury to be able to spend whatever amount of money on a purse but you know life is short give yourself a little treat once in a while i will start off with my newest purse um this one was very kindly gifted to me let me just say it's freaking gorgeous but here she is this is the teddy blake Gigi palmellato is in the black and red it's super pretty i love big purses i like them to have a lot of space and this one definitely has a lot i love the red it's like a carpeted red inside it's very fancy looking the leather the texture i love this leather so all their purses are made in italy they have premium leather and like i said they are more of an affordable luxury brand because they look very luxurious and also feels luxurious then you know you won't necessarily break the bank depending on which one you get or what you think is affordable they do also carry a lot of different bags they have this style in a pink and different colors they have some in different leathers and textures and everything so check them out i will link them in the description okay so moving on today actually i took a smaller purse because i do like small purses when i just have to like run an errand so this is the purse i use today this is my little kate spade i don't really know the names of these because some of these i've had for a good like five years and i just buy them and i don't even really look at the names so this is my little kate spade clutch is what i call it it's a really small bag um i I mean compared to me it's small because i'm a big girl so it will look smaller on me it might look bigger if you're like skinnier or smaller framed but for me it's pretty small and then in the back side it also has a compartment which you can put stuff but i think this is a really pretty bag as soon as i saw it i was like i need it inside it has the little spades and i just thought it was freaking adorable okay so this next purse is my oldest purse actually this is my very first kate spade purse and i believe i got this for like christmas i love this purse because I take it everywhere it has a lot of compartments so it has an opening here and then it has the actual inside of the purse and inside there's a little slit here where you can put something on the other side there's a zipper and you can put more stuff in there and then at the back of the purse it has another compartment a lot of space in this purse that's why I really like it and ride or die I love this one so much and I need to get a new one in this style because she is getting old let's change it up a little bit so this one here is a little coat bag and this one actually I pretty much took for my mother because my mom and my sister were obsessed with purses as well they literally if they were still into purses like how they were back in the day I could show you their collection and theirs would be even bigger and crazier because they were so obsessed with purses so my mom had like a lot of purses and she had this little cute one and when she kind of got out of the phase of collecting bags she just had them all like in a closet stacked on top of each other they were all getting bent and out of shape and everything so i told her i was like can i have this one and she's like okay so i just took it <laughs> This one has a strap as well and the you click it from here and the other side and that's the only thing I will say I don't like about this bag because it is such a pain in the ass when you want to put it on. It twists and twirls. It is so annoying. But other than that, I really like it. The back of it has a little slit which you can't really put much in there besides maybe some coins. I never put anything in there. And it's pretty much just one space and it does have a slit in the um, both sides of it. It has a slit so you can put stuff in there. Okay, so my next purse is one that girl, I was like on the hunt for this purse for so freaking long but I actually wanted it in a different color. This is a little Michael Kors 
Kors cross body bag and this is another one also that I tend to reach for a lot when I want to do something fast you know you can pretty much fit the same thing as a Kate Spade one you can fit your phone and a couple other items like a wallet and stuff um, but this one in particular I was in the hunt for it for like the longest time ever but I wanted it in black a solid black and every single time I would go to the Michael Kors store they never had it. It was always sold out because it was so popular. But I did find it finally. I found this one and I was like, you know what? This is the closest I'm going to get to something dark like black. So I took it and as you can see, it is like a very dark gray. It almost looks black, but it's obviously not. And it just has the MK all over, which I will say that I'm not the biggest fan of brands who blast their logo on purses. But for some reason, I was able to look past this one and I liked it because this is the only one I have that has like the logo everywhere hopefully um maybe i will purchase myself the black one because i really want it i literally still want it okay so let's bring it back to miss kate spade because like i said i love her this is another one that i got that was like my dream purse when i saw it because girl i love one thing about me is i love glitter and this one has a black glitter finish to it and it's like you can feel the glitter it's textured but it doesn't come off or it doesn't fall off it's super fine fine glitter that it just sparkles so much in the sun i wish it was a little bigger but this one is probably like small to medium size so yeah i love this one so like you guys notice most of my bags literally all my bags are black so this one here in particular has always been another one of my dream bags when i saw the model of it and i never found it in black and white because it does exist but i just it was sold out it's like super popular so when i went i'm like you know what i want this purse so bad that i'm just gonna go ahead and buy this color which is not that crazy but for me i guess you kind of could say it is because i never wear color bags not even white but this one here she's gorgeous i love her this purse is so freaking pretty and it's even prettier in black and white so pretty much the difference is that this tan part here would be black and this is white or some something like that but it's black and white the one that i wanted and this one is in a tan color the inside of it is super cute it's the tan color with the little spades inside it has a lot of space and I love it. I haven't really worn this one out that much, but it is one of my top top favorites. I love all my purses They're all literally like my favorite things ever um, But this one has a little bit more of a special place in my heart and I don't know why but I do love it I love it so much. This is my this was the last Kate Spade purse I ever purchased and I already I think it's been like a good almost two years since I purchased this purse and it's sad. I really want to go buy some more because I know they have cute bags all the time. So this purse that I'm going to show you is pretty old as well. My sister gifted it to me for my birthday a couple years back. It is a Michael Kors and this is what she looks like. She's a little bent out of shape because it's not stuffed with anything. But once you have like stuff in there, it looks more like more structure or whatever. But I like it. It has like that pinched look already to it, which I really like. And it has a strap and it also has um, your little handles. And it has a really big zipper in the front and it has a lot of space to put in there. Uh, it's divided. It has two compartments and then it has a zipper in the middle. And I love this one because I actually, when I do take my makeup where I take more items, I, I put them in the middle of this purse. That is what that bag is usually used for or the front one too because it's pretty deep and big. So yes, I really like this purse. It's one that I, I know I said this about all of them, but I do take this one out a lot when I have more stuff to stuff in here. So this purse that I'm gonna show you right now, it's my latest purse. I did haul it a couple videos ago and it's this one right here. She's so cute. I love this one when I first saw it. I was like, I have to have it. I love the leather. I think that's what got me the most was the leather and then the gold accent in the front. And it's pretty spacious. If you look on the inside, it has like a little purse inside as well. This is a little pouch where you could put stuff and then it has compartments on the side. It's almost like my Michael Kors one that it has a little bag on the inside. That's why I really liked it. And of course, it also has space before you open the bag in the front of it and the back side of it. And I also love the strap. The strap is actually really nice because it's a really thick band for the strap so i really like that and you can adjust it however you want the length and stuff 
really pretty I'm also not really a wallet person because the only thing I have in there is like my ID and my cards but like I have all that stuff on my phone so I don't ever really carry my cards but I do have one wallet that my sister gifted to me a couple Christmases ago and it's a really pretty Michael Kors glittery wallet but I cannot find it for the life of me I wanted to, I wanted to show you but if I find it while I'm editing this video I'll insert the clip right now but I do love that wallet I do love Halloween so I have two purses that are or like baggies that are Halloween themed that I wanted to show you because they're actually really cute um, I bought them they're like novelty purses of course but this one right here is a little glittery pumpkin and she's a little bit out of shape because I haven't used it recently I don't even remember I think I might have purchased it off of like she and like like years ago and I usually just have stuff in there like some pills and stuff but I don't really ever use it as much sometimes I will take it out but rarely it has a little glittery bat on the side and it is also like a chain I think it's so cute like I said it looks kind of funky because it's out of shape but super cute I love it and then the last one was also like a birthday gift and as you can see it's a little ghost face cross body bag and it's really cute I love it honestly it's so freaking adorable and it gets me compliments cuz girl look at it it's so cute and actually I do love this one so much that most of the time I tend to reach for this one when I go do a quick errand because it is the shape of it is really nice to put my phone and the inside of it is pretty big and it has a zipper and like three compartments inside it's crazy you wouldn't think you could fit a lot in this little bag but if it's essentials you can fit them all and it also has a storage in the front but I love it um, but anyways that was it for all my purses um i hope you guys enjoyed this video i hope you're watching and you love purses too because i love watching purse collection videos and trust me girl like i said i would have so many bags if i didn't collect perfumes because it definitely gets pricey even if they're under 200 300 like that adds up but anyways these are all my bags i hope you enjoyed this video if you did give me a thumbs up subscribe to my channel i hope i didn't look too crusty because i wasn't even looking at how i looked because of these damn purses but anyways i'll see you in my next video mm -hmm.